and welcome back to my YouTube channel. And if you're new here, welcome to my channel. This week, we are moving on to week number three of running. And I'm planning on running a 10K in either four to five weeks. We'll see how that goes. Um, so stay tuned for that. As for today, I just got back from the run. So stay tuned to see how I did. Spoiler alert, uh, I did surprisingly well, if I do say so myself. So it's a cloudy day today, but I went for a run and we did almost 4.75 kilometers today, which is insane for our first run this week. And I felt really good running it. So we could probably make it to five kilometers this week and then maybe push for like six or seven. I don't know, I don't know, but I was feeling super good. So I'm really into that. Um, at first when I started the run, I was feeling like a bit of stress and anxiety just because I, uh, I'll be moving next weekend, which you'll see in my vlog video that I'll be posting after uh, the run hobby because I don't want to like split up the run hobby with a vlog or maybe I'll just insert it randomly into the week I don't know yet but I do know that uh, I will be be posting a moving vlog video and next week we will not be running in this area because I will no longer be here um, but that's pretty exciting and I was feeling a little anxious a little stressed about that before the run so when I get anxiety and stuff like it's hard it's, it makes it harder to breathe so I didn't think I was gonna run that far today but then all that anxiety kind of went away while I was running I just like took it slow at the beginning and then I just felt refreshed and I was like running and running and like I can keep going and honestly I probably could have pushed to five kilometers but then I saw the apartment and all I was like was oh, okay time to rest I'm hungry and once again I forgot to film the intro uh, so I'll be inserting the intro after I'm done this spiel, which will be interesting because you'll already have seen it by the time you see this. So, hi! But yeah, I think this run today was successful. I felt really good and um, now I'm going to go and stretch it out and take a shower, go to the store, buy some stuff for breakfast and lunch, and yeah, time to eat. Also, side note, hair courteous of running in the wind. So you're probably asking yourself right now, why is Natalie rollerblading? I thought the hobby that she's doing for the next four to five weeks is running. This is weird. So instead of going for a run today, I had felt a little stressed out and just wanted to relax. So instead of putting my body through a bit of the strenuous running, I just put on some rollerblades and got in a little bit of an active rest day. So enjoy these clips of me rollerblading. Okay, so we're going for our second run this week. I know I had to take a few days break in between our run on Sunday and the run today, which is Wednesday. Monday, it was just a full rest day. And yesterday, as you can tell, I went uh, rollerblading um, instead of running because I just didn't feel like running. So today we're gonna go out and we're gonna try for a good run. Hopefully we can do the same run or run longer and get to a 5K today, but we'll see about that one. But as you can see, getting myself packed up and ready to go Go on Saturday I'm moving out so by the time this comes out in 24 hours I will have already started moving my things and you guys can stay tuned for that moving vlog coming out soon but yeah so yeah as you can tell we've got the moving boxes started and uh, we'll continue packing today after our run but I'm gonna get out for a run now because if I don't do it now I'm gonna get distracted by all the packing once again it'll be like Monday and Tuesday and I won't go for a run so let's get out there now and see if we can push for that 4.75 or 5k run so let's go. Today we ran that 5k, which is insane. We finally made it to the five kilometers, which I am quite proud of myself for, honestly, because that was a very tough road to run to get to the 5k, but it usually is, not gonna lie. The last time I tried to run a 10k, getting to that five kilometer mark was the hardest part. And then from that five kilometer mark to get to that 10 kilometer mark gets a lot easier. So hopefully we'll still be right on track for making that 10K next week or the following week. So with the move that I'm having this this week where I'm moving from my apartment out, it's a lot, it's a lot of stress that's going on in my life. So I 
will only be doing three runs this week, unlike what I was hoping for, which was four to five runs in week two, three, four, and five. But that's okay, because just making it to five kilometers this week is amazing, and I feel like we totally made up for the whole fact that I only did three runs this week because of it. Now I'm gonna go ahead and start stretching, and you guys can watch that, and then I'm gonna go upstairs and take a shower, and uh, I'll see you tomorrow for our last run. Okay, and now it is time to go inside, take a shower, and get ready for packing boxes, which you'll see when my next vlog comes out, because why not? Figured, you know who will love to watch me pack up? My YouTube subscribers, because isn't that cool? No? Yes, maybe? I don't know. You tell me. Oh yes, and disclaimer, that, that is a fanny pack, and yes, I do own one. They are the best ever, and if you're a runner and you don't have a fanny pack, 10 out of 10 would suggest because it's the most convenient way to hold all your stuff, especially in the summer when you don't have pockets, um, at least for women's clothes. Most of them don't come with pockets, so fanny pack. So yeah, I'm pro fanny pack. So I'm back from my run and guess what came in the mail? I got my electrolytes, which is super exciting. I've uh, already opened it to see what was inside. So I'm gonna go ahead and make one of these cause that was a hot run. Guess we're having lemonade flavor. Ta-da! Interesting. Also, excuse the mess in my room. <sighs> That's good. I'm actually surprised. Usually these things that you pour into your water don't taste good. But I'm digging it. I like it. Success. <laughs> Okay, that was our last run of this week and we ran, I believe that run was five kilometers again, so we made it to five kilometer runs guys and that's pretty exciting and to be able to hold that all week basically for each of the three runs that I did, I'm just saying I'm impressed with myself. So I'm ready for next week and next week I'll actually push myself and we'll see how far we can go. But for this week, those were our runs. Uh, I have to continue packing so unfortunately this video might be a little shorter than usual but all in all, I really enjoyed this week. I think I felt very accomplished this week with being able to do all those runs. Um, I definitely think that I'm becoming way more fit than I was two weeks ago starting these runs. I can definitely feel and see the muscle tone um, just from running itself, which is pretty grand. And I'm pretty happy about that. And that and also obviously my stamina is up given how great my runs have been this week. So that concludes this week and I hope you guys enjoyed the video even though it might have been slightly shorter than my usual videos. I look forward to seeing you guys next week and stay tuned for the vlog video which I don't know if I'm gonna publish it just randomly in the week so you guys can see what happened or like publish it after this hobby but stay tuned for that one and let me know actually what you guys would like to see. Would you like to see the video in the next like week or two or would you like to see the video after the hobby is done? Let me know. It's the last time you're gonna see me in this bathroom, in this apartment, in this house, uh, running in this area because next week I'll have moved into the cottage and be running along the lake which that's pretty sweet. I, I'm, I'm really digging that one. I think uh, I think those videos are gonna be a lot more entertaining, at least for me, because I'll have run with a, a view. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching, and don't forget to like the video if you really enjoyed the video. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button, that little notification bell, and I will see you next week. I don't know what else I wanna say. Mm. This is quite the style I have going.